What's up guys? We got more wrestling otaku nonsense to talk about. So, apparently wrestling otaku has gotten himself into a little feud with someone else. Wrestling otaku and this guy have an on again off again relationship where this guy tries to make nice with wrestling otaku only for wrestling otaku to turn out to be a giant asshole and insult him and threaten him and be a giant dickhead and this guy has had enough he's gonna come to maryland he's gonna come to maryland to see old wrestling otaku now for someone like wrestling otaku who sits there and talks shit and pretends to be a big tough guy who can take down anyone with his super kicks you would think that wrestling otaku would say great come to maryland let's deal with our differences like men but if you think that you haven't been watching these videos because wrestling otaku does what he always does he posts a 20 minute crying whining rant where he tells the guy that you're not worth my time and even if you do come here i'm just gonna call the police on you because wrestling otaku is a giant fucking coward and he can't handle one man showing up to his house to handle their business he's going to cry and whine and hide and call the police so he's gonna hide that's his signature move he's gonna hide like the big shit talking baby he is because that's all he is, a big shit-talking baby who's scared of other people who are actually men. I guess we'll see what happens. I think I know what's going to happen. I think Wrestling Otaku is going to hide and cry, and then as soon as this guy leaves town, he's going to claim that he won. Because he's a coward, and all he can do is talk shit when no one's nearby, and then hide when they come nearby. Pretty much showing the entire world that he's a fucking joke. So thanks for watching guys. Have a good day.